Boulder's second annual Walk and Wag has residents lacing up their shoes to walk for a cause. We offer a one mile and three mile course and all of the proceeds that we make today will go towards the building fund. The animal shelter and care of Jefferson County workers are currently fostering animals in their homes as they are working towards building the first animal shelter for Jefferson County, which has over 12,000 residents. This last two years has been, has dramatically increased on um, the strays and dumped animals in our county basically because we don't have a shelter. Without an animal control division, it leaves stranded animals and calls to the Jefferson County Sheriff's Office. But Darlene Moyer and Cheryl Hassacker, volunteers have been trying to raise money for a 5,000 square foot building to house 20 dogs and 42 cats on Muskrat Lane. Our hopes and dreams are is to help the community in any way so they can keep their animals. And the community says there is a significant need for shelter and a place to go for pet vaccinations and checkups. Uh, growing up in Boulder, there was always the stray dog running around, stray cat. And uh, I think it would be a great, a great uh, addition to, to Boulder and the Boulder Valley, especially with population growing. Plus, for Cassie Strasser and Sarah Rader, it would be nice to not drive 30 miles just for a pet appointment. It's just kind of nice to be able to have a, a community uh, thing for uh, everybody to come together with their animals and uh, do things as a, as a community and, and take care of the animals and not have to go all the way into Helena for those kinds of things. One and we need one. We got a lot of pets around here, a lot of animals that need homes. and. Uh, some stray animals, a lot of those, and it'll be just a great thing for them. But it will take a lot of community effort to make the shelter a reality. I love seeing the amount of people coming, getting together, the open air, open space, working towards the common goal of helping other animals. In Boulder, Jordan Johnson, MTN News.